Hello and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. So, we have done everything we need to do to get Madarame's heart. And now, we're gonna be leaving. To the museum entrance we go. Oh, uh, okay. Inmate. This was unexpected. You seem to be doing well, inmate. Come inside. We've much to discuss. We have an important matter to discuss regarding your rehabilitation. Okay, sure then. Um, unexpected, but... There you are, inmate. Our master admires the progress of your rehabilitation, and hence has given you use of a special ritual. Oh, that's very nice of him. It's the electric chair. Oh. Used to sacrifice personas and transmutate them into high-level items. I mean, could you not have given it a nicer name, like the fun item chair? Um, okay then. Any further questions regarding this ritual can be directed toward our master himself. He's apparently going to consider making even more rituals if your rehabilitation goes as planned. Oh. Work hard for it, inmate. Are we going to get firing squad and hanging next? Just my guess. Anyway, um, hello, Igor. <laughs> um. Time for some rehabilitation. I guess we'll use the electric chair. Some modification, huh? This ritual lets you sacrifice personas and transmute them into high-level items. You'll lose the persona, but you'll get things like useful weapons and accessories. We'll record the transmutation results of each persona in the inmate registry. You'd better be grateful. Each time you make a sacrifice, you'll need to use a special material with the potential for transmutation. You probably have no idea what it is, so take this one and get clued in. You'd better show your gratitude for it. You should be able to find them in your own reality, too. Not just the other one. Do your best to find them. Okay, so we got a black Kogatana. Okay. So, uh, I assume that's the top one? So you lose the persona, but you get an item. Oh, uh, wait a second, is this- It appears it will become something protective. This uses the black rock. Okay, so this is our crafting system. Oh, cool. I see. Well, it will become a weapon. We get a weapon which is 130 attack, which is like 30 above what he has right now, and then strength plus five. That's incredible. Yeah, behold, that's a huge you upgrade. Fall. And we know that Am Ami no Yuzumi isn't gonna get the fray skill naturally, so I think that we can probably get rid of it now. Yeah, go ahead. Now be reborn. It's the only reason why we were keeping it. Oh no, I didn't register. Well. Oops. <laughs> Little bit late for that. I was like, I didn't register the persona. It is well dead. Okay, before we do anything more, uh, let's register like our other persona. Registration? You would like to register this? Yeah, sure. As a definite Time oops on my part. They will be reborn anew. So we this would use our regent, but what do we it get from it? It it will become something protective. So you get a plus three strength, and then it also has a uh, thing associated with it. Sure, why not? This I mean, I didn't really. The result. Well, I mean, here's the other thing. What can we merge that regent into? You wish to perform an execution? Use fire result. You want? Uh, yeah, some of these use the regent. Wait, can we use the regent to make an am I mean no use whatever, see? <laughs> Let me have a look here. I have a calculator up. Can I use a regent to create this? Uh, I could use a regent and a uh, Lenan uh, City, which we don't have. Okay, so no is the answer. Oh wait, no, we could create one right there. It's <laughs> there it is, Li Lianan City. I believe it's all it's pronounced differently. Wait, so we could fuse that, and then we could fuse into the Amino no Yuzumi, use the, and then pass the fray across? That's an option. Let me have a look at this Looks thing. Pretty tough. So we could create that. It's also a Psy one, but we would be getting rid of the Psy stuff. 
Then we could fuse that into the one that we need, which would then allow us to get the strength thing. Or, alternatively, we use it for here and we get our region. Interesting. Um, I think I'm going to get the item. It appears it will become yeah, I think we'll have protected. other opportunities to get what we're looking for here. And we'll get we'll have other opportunities to get a region, I assume. Yeah, and this is this appears to be the only thing we can use the black rock for, so I assume it's kind of intended. Behold, it's yeah. new for let's uh, a new get form. it. Right, so I'm gonna skip the uh, execution this time, and we now have our item. Cool. Well, that went okay. You change your mind. Right, I'm gonna finished? back out here. What? And in back, uh, no, I have business here. First things first, I want to equip these things. So let's equip you with your new weapon. Yeah, so that's a huge increase and, uh, yeah, so, and you get the plus five strength. So that's just good. Then we have this, which is another plus three strength. So it seems like that would be great on you, potentially. Okay, let's try that. And I also want to have a look at the challenge. Do you Hello. Need something? Uh, I would like to check the level 20 challenge. Okay, so uh, you get a bunch of rewards, but more importantly, let's see what we got. So you got nuclear attack times four, you got a Yosuke takedown score times seven. Okay, interesting. Uh, I wonder if you get, like, whether you, if you take down with nuclear, you get additional bonuses. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. You know what we might do is we might pat, we might keep him where he is, because he has his physical skills that do a lot of damage and they're good on baton passes, and then use nuclear to set them up. Red band's the one that increases fire, right? I think it is, yeah. So, Ryuji, what's your Ring of Lust do? Champion's Cup. Yeah, we'll get rid of that for just now. I'll just switch to something else. Uh, we will take off the Atom Ring, because we already have an Atom person. Um, see what else we got here, whether anything seems good. Uh... I'll take the Champion's Cup then, just as something to use. If we have nothing else, you can have the Atom Ring. Yeah, let's head in here. Do you let's try need something? it. it. We're probably not going to get the top level, but I want to just see what happens. So, what were the rewards? So, Heat Wave Belt. It gets you Heat Wave, a belt that helps its wearer knock down anything. Then you got Dodge Ice, and then you got Silver Lump. I don't really have a great desire for any of this, apart from the fact that it's a challenge it's given me. So within 28 actions, which is quite a lot of actions, really, nuclear attack score gets you times four, and then a Yosuke takedown score is times seven. Let's go. Sure. I don't know whether we should be using both Yosuke and the nuclear at the same time to get, like, a huge bonus. I don't know whether that's something we should be doing, but... Let's, let's not do it for the first one and see how things go. This one's strong against gunshots. So weak to don't nuclear. It's weak to wind. Weak to bless. This one hmm, and then weak to fire. fire. Won't work. This one's strong Here's the thing, though. Don't waste your I don't really want to hit it with that. I want to hit it only with nuclear. That's the thing. I only really want to hit all of these guys with nuclear. Hmm. Or Dormina. Wait, yeah, if I use the sleep, I can then technical the nuclear. Oh, yeah. Let's try that. Let's try putting you to sleep. So I can now technical the nuclear if I wanted to. I'm trying to think. So if I don't technical the nuclear here, what am I going to do? It'll go to on, and then sleep the one on the left, and then I can triple nuclear after that, potentially. You know what I might do? Just use nuclear for no reason. As in, it'll just get us some points on the board. Right, so do Stormina here. That's horrible. Um, right. All right. We, we have to try it anyway. So let's use. That's not Bufu. Oh, you don't have. Yes, you, we need to use you to. Ah, yes. For some reason, I thought he also had to kill it. So we could technical here, but that's not going to get us the kill. Uh. Here. Sure. Let's just do this. This is bad. I think I've already failed this one, but. That's okay. Yeah, this is really bad. 
Okay, right. Let's try this again. So, uh, switch to this thing. Use free on the middle guy. Cool. Gets us some points. We then baton pass to Ryuji. We then hit you with the free technical. We then baton pass to Yosuke. Who then uses his uh, baton pass for the kill. Which is a lot of points, which is good. Then use this again. Then we're gonna put this one to sleep. Nice. your health is low. Watch out. Hmm. Uh I would like to, to heal, probably. Uh this has not gone ideally, I would say. I could technical this guy, but it only really matters if we kill. Uh I'm just gonna guard. This is kinda bad. Taunt forces attacks, but we missed. Okay. So we can technical the fray. So we technical fray, switch to Ryuji. Fray the the paper guy, switch to Yusuke, kill this guy. Yeah. You're mine. Nice one. They're at your mercy. Oh, I thought technic Okay. Maybe I'm wrong. This is still possible. Yeah, now we can get on pass. I thought technical set up set it up, that's fine. You have enough to do this, right? And kill. There we go. And it crit. Nice. Baton pass back. And uh, free. Which is fine because we couldn't kill it with physical anyway. So now we're at 10,000. Does it reset completely? It does. Alright. Okay, that's fine. Okay, ice we can knock down with uh, Yusuke. Electric. So we could obviously nuclear electric ice, right? We could do that. Yeah, that seems good. Even though the electric doesn't really set us up properly. Right, let's baton pass over. So this is kind of a wasted point, but we're using it to get the big points on the ice. Nice. Switch over here. We still need to heal him, but that's okay. I mean, heavy power ice. Wasn't a kill. Oh no. We can baton pass again, but there's no reason to. Yeah, kill. Yeah, that was kind of bad. Uh, you? Free? Um, I wonder if we can stick one to sleep. Hmm. Oh, you know what we should do? Just this? heal. I appreciate it. Keeps them up. Okay. This is my other self. I could use vicious strike to try and kill him. Let's go. Maybe. Or just try and kill this one for physical. What's it weak to? I don't think go, we're going to be able to go, kill that guy, this but this one I think self. we could kill for a giant slice. Prepare Let's try yourself. it. That, that was 800 points. Okay. <laughs> Killed most of our group. Um, okay. Yep, this is pretty bad. Is there a way of leaving? There is not a way of leaving. Okay. Um. Hmm. I don't really want to use items. I guess I'm going to use this. Just get our points. We're dead. Hmm. Okay. There's definitely a path through, potentially, there. I'm just thinking about it there. Hmm. I changed my equipment around. Let's give... Mm, let's give on the at... Yeah, let's let's switch this up. I'm going to take the atom ring off of you. I'm going to give on the atom ring. 
So she's now going to set that up. Ryuji, instead of that, you're going to have the... I guess you could have your... Hmm. No, maybe I give him the attack buff back again. Yeah. And then we would have the what afterwards. Maybe the nullify weakness one. Uh, Sure, let's just put on the nullify weakness one. Give Ryuji the... That one back. Let's try it one more time, and then I think we'll you move on. Something. And I'll think about it more later. I think it's worth trying one more time. Yeah, at least so we can get the first one of the three. The other ones are difficult. But yeah, we didn't even manage to survive this one. So, that's not great. I think our start wasn't too bad. But we are a little low level. Okay, so... Let's work this out. Against gunshots. Don't waste your bullets. Less attacks won't do anything. This one. Unless, of course, what we do is we bless, hit that one down. Nuclear. What are you weak to? This one. Fire. Is weak to fire. So we could bless, nuclear, kill. I don't really like that. It's time. Yeah, actually, I kind of want the rings the other way around again, but that's okay. This is fine. Or we we could nuclear fire. This one yeah. Is weak to so fire. nuclear, hit this one with fire, kill it with your stick. It's weak to bless attacks. Do we have any? Yeah, let's, let's try go. that. So I'm gonna switch up to using. Hmm, let's see here. So, no, we're in the right one. Yeah, do this. Okay, fair. Right, switch up to on. Go ahead. He's then gonna use Aji. Okay, baton pass over to Yusuke. He's now gonna use this. Which critical for 10... It got 10,000 points due to how much damage it did off the critical. My lord. Right, you already have an attack up. Let's attack up here. There we go. So now we have two attack ups. You have free. So let's hit this one again. Just for some free points. Can we even hit this one really? We could do with ice, but not really. Uh, what are we using him for? I mean, I guess I'll just... I don't know. Increase his evasion. It's not great, but it's something to do. Stands up. Double shots. Well, she needs healed. Nice miss. Alright, let's think. Uh, I could bless. I can hit this one with bless. Then hit this one with fray. Then switch to Yosuke and kill this one. Yeah, I think that's our plan. So I want to hit this one with bless. Yeah. Go down. And that's nice. Baton pass over to on. Who can then hit with fray? Which is good, it's now very low. Baton pass over to Yosuke. Who's then gonna use this for the big hit. Another crit, 4,000 points. Nice, that unlocked the first level. You immediately heal on. She needs the heal. Did break her path. Uh, and given that we don't have an easy... Well, we have two choices here. We can get the four times nuclear attack, or we can hold off. Actually, can I hit it this with a sleep? Let's try this. Yeah. So now I can technical the Bufu, which is okay. That gets us seven times. That's not bad. So we're actually really close to getting the full reward. Because all we need to do is get to... All we need to do is get to 35,000. Wait, we've got the full reward if we just win, right? It's time. Because all we have to do is get to 35,000. 
Yeah, so th from this point onwards, we just need to win, right? Because that puts where all we need to do is get 159 points, and then we win as long as we win in 20 actions. So now it's just win the fight. Oh, now it's win the fight. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna shoot this one, I think, and just kill it. Nice. See, now if we win, we're good. Uh, you're weak to electric. And you're weak to I. Okay, so we're, let's switch up to electric. Hit you with the zeal. Nice. Baton pass over here to Yusuke. Go to Yus Yusuke. And then use Bufu. Nice. Um, I might use it again. Just to get the kill. Which is nice. Uh, Zeal. Then... Just for points sake, I'll do this. Flip to a sleep. And then technical it with this thing. Nice. We're actually almost going to hit 35 without this even needing the plus 15,000, which is quite nice. Electricity is ineffective. You got so that's Psy. That's really difficult to take out then. Wind. Is no good. Use nuclear. Different. Wait, which one's weak to nuclear? You're weak to nuclear. Okay, so we can take you out. So that's this one with on. So the other two... Ice is no good. It's mm. weak to wind. I can take you, yeah, like, if I can hit you with a wind one. Do I have winds? I must have wind on somebody. Yeah, I have Garu on you. Perfect. Hit you. Nice. Baton pass over to On. Then hit you with three. To knock another one down. See, we're already at 28,000. What are they weak? Ice is no good. It's weak to wind. Electricity is ineffective. You got it's weak I'm just checking something here. Yeah, okay. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to baton pass to Yusuke. And then I'm going to use my AoE attack. The vicious strike. And hope for a kill. We got two kills with that. That's fantastic. This middle guy is a little bit of a problem. Do we have anything that can affect him at all? We could try and forget. Didn't hit him with anything. Okay. Sleep allows us to trigger off of him. You know what? Guard. Skip his turn. Yeah. That was the correct move, was to skip his turn there. Right, now we can hit him with whatever we like. But what we should do, if we're going for maximum points, is we should switch over to this thing and hit him with a free. Nice. Followed by... I could try and make him forget, or we can try Rampage for just even more... No, let's try Rampage. Ah, oh, that's horrible. Right, sleep it. Let's go. Hmm. Uh, technical? Oh, we critical! Nice. We can baton pass. Over to. Guess we'll go here. I don't have any psychokinesis, uh, unfortunately. Hmm. Who is the most damage out of my guys here? 12? You don't have any physical attacks though, magic wise? We are kind of looking at you actually. Hit it? That wasn't this enough, it's gonna attack back now. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> it almost killed me. This really doesn't do enough damage. Do I have anything else I can chuck at it? Wait, do I have a Psy thing? Chance of inflicting insta-kill. That seems like a little unfair. Um, use that block, maybe? Hmm. If 
trying to figure out how we hurt it. I can try and put it to sleep and then technical it, maybe? Maybe? Do I have something? You have Dormina. That's what I should have done last turn. I should have stuck it to sleep. And then hit it with this thing. Nope. We're screwed. We're okay, actually. Okay, we just need to kill. Dormina, it heals, or I just attack. Let's go. Do I have something that does... <sighs> I'm like, do I have anything that's going to kill it? What, what, no. Alright, what do you like? What's your... This enemy's weak to psychokinesis. Everything else is the same. My gun only has one, has no shots left in it. Zona. <sighs> Six actions? I might try putting it to sleep. All right. Well, that's horrible, obviously. <laughs> well, that missed. So it heals a little bit. Yeah, that was the correct move, I think. Now we can technical it with anything. Let's technical it with this because there's a chance to burn. Nice, there we go. And we get our 15,000 points. There we go, 47,000. That's not bad. Cool. Okay, you've impressed me. That was pretty good. <laughs> we got some lucky crits early, which made that very easy. A spectacular result for sure. Yeah, so we get the dodge ice and the heat wave belt. But the crits early that gave us like 10,000 points, I think made that slightly easier than it needed to be. Um, or quite slightly easier than it should have been, I should say. Um, so this is heavy physical damage to all foes. That's really good. What were we using before? <laughs> right, switch that on. On? You're gonna, oh, we were using the atom ring before, that's fine. On is gonna switch back to using the fire one. Yosuke can stay on that one. Ryuji. This is fine. Yeah, I think we're okay for a current setup. Well, that was very successful. I'm gonna say write something. Because we can. There we go. And then we're gonna leave. Okay. That went that went very well. No slacking off. That challenge, uh I think was meant to more be more difficult than it was. <laughs> We have some luck, lucky what crits. What is the matter? Is something wrong? You appear to be lost in thought. Shall we be off? Excellent. No problems all around. Shall we get going? All right, we're off. What do you want to do? And let's return to the real all world. Right. That's settled. Fascinating. I cannot even begin to fathom what Madarami's treasure may be. Either way, we'll steal it for sure. Oh, and you did you all did great today. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yes! We finally secured our route to the treasure. All we need to do now is send the calling card. Yeah. Yep, this is just saying send the calling card. And it's now evening. Just to point out how long we've been in there. Okay. You did great today, you tired? We'll do it in a second. All we have to do now is send the calling card to Madarame. All right, it's finally time. All we gotta do now is decide when we're gonna do it. Shouldn't we talk to Yusuke about this first? Uh, why? I mean, Madarame was his teacher. It's not our place to be deciding something like this. Oh yeah, let's talk to Yusuke. Yeah, this problem's bigger than just the three of us. Anyway, how about we all meet up at the hideout? Yup, sounds good. Okay, let me know when you want to meet and I'll tell you, Yusuke. I just want to show how long we've been in here. You see this here? This is the home shopping program. Which we've already used. That's how long we've been in there. The fact that it seems like we should have a new thing on TV, but yet it's the same day. Anyway, that was fun. Uh, we have nothing to do with him because we have, uh, like, been in a palace slash mementos thing. So, I don't know. What are we going to do? We have a DVD we could read. That's not the correct phrase. 
You have a DVD we could watch. Oh, you know what we also could do? We only have one lockpick. Let's uh, make ourselves some more lockpicks. Okay. We can make four? All right, sure, I will make four. Yeah. That's sure to make life a little bit easier. You made four lockpicks. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Our proficiency is probably gonna like be four before some of ours have left two at this rate. Well, then. Okay, let's go to bed. It's so far ahead. A, we're at seven percent of people believing in us. You ride this train at this time too. <laughs> what a coincidence. Do you not know that from when you were following us? We finished investigating the palace. All that's left is the calling card. When are you going to send it? Hmm. After we prepare. So the more important it is, the more cautious we should be. You have a point. You are dependable as I thought. I'll leave the timing of the calling card in your care. Okay. So now we're on to afternoon. Oh, have you heard? Madarame, the ma maestro of the art world. Artists with that good an eye are rare in Japan. I wonder if he has synthesia. Yes, regarding synthesia. One of many English terms that come from Greek root words. Haven't heard of it? It's a condition where your senses can cross over each other, like seeing music as color. There are all kinds of varieties though, and some sense combinations are more common than others. We call people who experience this phenomenon synthes thin synesthites. Mr. Zapla, you were staring off into space, weren't you? Well, your number's up. The root words of synthesia are sin and athesia. What do these mean? Um... She wants to know what the root words mean? It's all Greek to me, but I can give it a try. Ha ha ha, all Greek to me. Here, let's think about this. It'll be easier if we put our heads together. Okay, let's start with sin. I'm not sure I like these bits in the... Like, the reason why I don't like this bit is because we can't fail it. Like, all of these types of ones where uh, we have Morgana speaking to us, you'll, like, he'll go, nah, that's not right, if we get it wrong. So it's like, well, it's a very odd situation. The previous one, and then you get a reward one way or another. It's all kind of very odd s scenes. Anyway, I think that's in a lot of other words too, like synergy and synchronicity and synthesis. If we think about what these words might have in common, then maybe sin means... See, like, I can show you here. If I say, it means opposite. No, I don't think that's it. These words have something in common. You see what I mean? So if you get it wrong, it's just like, let's just restart. Okay, it's together. That's it. Sin means together or a combination of something. And a, th a thesis, huh? That's a little like the word aesthetics. Um, if you say so. I wonder if it means senses. Yeah, that's it. Sounds like we know the definitions of the root words. So that means the full word basically means, I mean, I bet even if I chose the wrong option here, it would just reset. But senses coming together? Nice. Yeah, that's it. Phew, we really got to stay on our toes in this class. But I guess maybe this section is just so that, like, this is like a here's the information, let's see if you can remember it at the exam kind of situation, just to mix things up a little bit. I could use a snack after all that brain power. Let's get a treat after this. This is it. Good. You've been studying. Unfortunately, synthesis is something you have to be born with. You can't learn it. Some of the geniuses over the course of history have had synthesis. The composer Franz Litz constructed it instructed his orchestra to play the color purple. The poet Arthur Rimbaud was said to have seen colors in letters. No way. He's pretty smart. I didn't expect that. He might not be too bad. Nice going! You're on a roll today! Cool, we got a knowledge point. Seeing colours and sounds and letters, and the feeling shapes and flavours and letters and numbers, uh, geniuses and common people see the world differently. Were you able to understand that? I see. Synthesia, huh? That's fascinating. Although, the reason Madarame sees the world differently is because of his distorted desires. Okay, after school. So 
we got a text message. Oh, regarding my research. So, regarding my research, do you have any time today? If you're free, I'd like to get some more input from you. Hmm, should we go? I mean, I'm just thinking here. Um, ooh, what we got over here? Hmm? I've been feeling down lately. There was the Kamoshida incident and now all these fraud cases. Any places selling anything special for the spring season? Something yummy will cheer me up. Do you know a place called Super Muramasa? It's the supermarket they have over in Yonjin Jaya. Oh, I know that one. Their spring fruit pack would probably do just the trick. Oh, I already bought that. Fruits, huh? Enjoying some fruit does sound nice and relaxing. Okay, so we already have their special. Um, let me think of anything else. Monday, we don't need to do anything. We don't need to do the lottery until the 25th. Is there anything else we need to do in the entire place? I'm like, thinking. In the game, there is nothing else we need to do, so... Yeah, I guess we can go see the, uh... Yeah, we can go see the counselor, can't we? That's fine. We could jump directly in and do Madarame's thing, like send the calling card, but I think we might be okay. Yeah, I think we're okay just uh, spending a couple days raising our confidant levels. I don't think there's any reason to do it specifically quickly. Uh, why am I running around trying to find the office instead of just using the IM? Oh no. Oh, th these people have new things. Hmm? Are you going to the Madarame exhibit? I hear it's pretty amazing. Yeah, I actually wanted to check it out, but when the exhibit's open, I've got cram school. If you like, I'll ask my dad if he can pull some strings, and you can visit after closing hours. Wait, seriously? That means I get to go for free even though it's super popular? That's crazy! Ooh, hello. Hmm, my ranking didn't improve like I hoped. I hope I won't get, I won't get into the school I want at this rate. Oh no! Threats are no joke, don't you think? I'm scared of going home after cram school. Have you been getting that junk mail too? I'm sure it's just a scam. Junk mail about threats from when you're going home after school? We haven't heard anything about that yet. I just wanted to check what's going on with the bully. Hmm? I'm sorry for everything. I'll pay you back, I swear. Don't worry about the money. Is everything okay with you? No, I'll talk to Sakoda Senpai and get you your money back. I just want to do the right thing for once. I won't drag you into it. Oh, cool. So we have caused a change of heart. Awesome. Might be more new people to speak to, but um, I think we've got most people. Oh, hello. Uh, what are you doing here with your... Yeah, with your manga. Which appears to be about a... I don't know, I'm looking at this here. Um, I think it's a hard-boiled detective one, maybe? That's, that's my guess. I'm trying to see over her shoulder. There is actually stuff in here. Like, this is properly written. I mean, it's probably not, you know, in detail. But, like, if you go close enough, you can actually see you got some pages written out. Yeah, okay. That, that's kind of neat. Anyway, hello. Oh. Are you alone today? I heard you were quite the troublemaker, but you seem to be behaving yourself. Okay. She's not really that sneaky, is she? Hello. I bet you would hate counselling. You're gonna try and... They're, they're, I bet you would hate counselling. You're gonna try and solve everything with sheer will, right? Quite the contrary. Mental health is just as important as physical health in sports. Unless you have control of your mind, your body won't move the way you want it to. Oh, now that you say that, I always miss my shots when it's most important. I wonder if I'll get better by going to counselling. Interesting. We know the counsellor's at the end here. Hello. The false hero Kamishida has fallen. Chuchin Academy's future is hope, so long as I'm around. False hero? He, yes. Kamashita tricked people into thinking he was a hero, but he wasn't. Oh, and don't tell anyone about my true identity. No one can know that I'm a phantom thief. Yeah, I won't tell anyone. Hmm? Oh, they don't have anything new. I think we've had some... Uh, wait, maybe they do have something new. It didn't look new here, but that's okay. Aha, those phantom thieves are hilarious. Kamashita had it coming to him. I wish they'd do that to all the teachers that bug me. Oh, but definitely not you, Sensei. Don't talk bad about your school like that. The day will come when you'll miss your alma mater. Um, but I really feel that way. Even the internet's making fun of our teachers right now. Hmm. Hello. Hmm? It's so nice that we're able to use the gym. It really motivates me when we practice. The volleyball team faded away so suddenly. That's lucky for us, though. 
How things were run when Kamoshida was around didn't make sense. This is more like it. Okay, so the other clubs are all settling back into normality. I'm going to continue exploring, because there's a lot more dialogue than I thought there was going to be in school. She's following me. I didn't notice that before, but she follows you all around. That's, that's neat. Yeah, you see, she comes around here, then stops when she realizes... It. Yeah, then she stops when she realizes you've noticed her. That is really neat. Okay, I like it. Just a small thing. That's kind of cool. When I head up here, is she going to appear behind us? Or is she in front of us already? Or she'll only appear on the bottom floor. She might only appear on the bottom floor. Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, what if I head down here? I'm going to try and make her appear, which is... Oh, we already have the uh, creepy stalkers on this level. No, uh, she's not here. Wait a second, what? Oh, it was a bag. I was very confused there about what something was, but it was just a bag sticking out over the edge of a, uh, like, area. That's okay. Check the other place here. Are we clear? I think we're clear. Yeah. Let, let's answer our I am. Yeah, I'll come join you. Why not? That's great. I'll be waiting in the nurse's office. Hello. This is rough on my eyes. Seems like allergies are kicking in for everyone. You holding up okay? If you're okay with it, I'd like to get some input from you. Do you have time right now? There's no pressure, obviously, but... Yeah. Hmm. Oh, but... What do we need? Leave we need the me. Counselor Arcana. Decline. I see. So actually, I need to go to the velvet room first because we need to get the. Uh, yes, because we need to go and get our uh, counselor Arcana. Jump in. Well, I love that. The little animation's great. Right, in we go. Back to the velvet room. Uh, we've uh, spent a long time not in here this episode, so. Um. Let's just have a look. First of all, uh, do we have any right now? We have none with us right now. We only have four we can merge from, or fuse from. One is a counselor here, but it's level 22, which is too high a level for us. Okay. You change your mind, well, um, these are the paths you let's see. So by Arcana, counselor. So we haven't got the level 12 one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go by level, and I'm going to head down here. Oh, this one's interesting. It's level 11 one, Orpheus. Let me just have a look at this here. Uh, how do I even have? Yeah, if I go this in. Persona? Oh, interesting. So what's it got as its thing? Revives with one HP when KO'd, usable four times per battle. That's insane. Uh, and it has a buff for everything. Um, and it revives with one HP, and it also has this one. Wow, this is OP as hell for a level. Um, yeah. For a level 11 one. Okay. Crazy. What's his background? A persona of another story. A poet skilled with the lyre. He tried to retrieve his wife from Hades, but she vanished when he looked back before reaching the surface. Persona from another story? Huh. I wonder which game that one's from. Hmm. I know that some of them. I know, like, uh, if we go all the way down he here in this circle back around. Like, I know that this one is and this one are from 4. I don't know what the rest are from, but interesting. Anyway, so that's just a reference one. Um, anyway, that's not what my plan was. My plan was to go down here and then just start buying is some personas. Just buy the cheap persona? ones. This Why am I going to do that? Well, my logic is, is if I buy these required? personas, this is your power. then what's going to happen is it's going to allow us to required, merge together some of them to create the uh, counselor one. Is required, then accept this and then just get as many as we can. can hold no such okay, cool. So then I can go into here. For some you wish Fusion. Fused by results. And then we should be able to find... There's a counselor one. Yeah, that not was my terrible, logic. But not impressive. So we're merging together the succubus and the uh, inugami. Cool. Uh, what's its background? One of the four aspects of Shinto thought. It uses its power to bring good omens. It is sent to aid in one's wisdom, observation, and skill, and can mend fractured paths. Select the hmm. skills you'd like to inherit. 
So, what's its spe- its one is Glutton Mouth. Increases the amount of HP restored to self by 50%. Okay, that's neat. Um, this one has a bonus associated, which is Baton Pass. Burn. Doesn't have any of that, I'm still gonna take it. The reason I'm gonna take it is because it says bonus. Uh, and that's about my full it reasoning for it. A fraction of power. And my, then hopefully my. we'll get some other kind of thing from doing that. I don't think any of the three were good. Uh, skip, skip the animation, and then here's our new persona. Hi, I'm Kushi Miyatama. Um, I'll bring some vigor back to your body. Come on, let's check out the mysterious nature of this world. Uh, it's the creepy persona. I see. Level up. Nice, we get regenerate one, which is 2% of max HP each turn in battle. Doesn't seem like a lot, but I'm thinking about that here. If we say that each battle is like three to four turns, let's say you do 10 of them in a palace, right? Let's say three turns, 10 of them in a palace. Uh, so that's 30, let's say you do 30 turns. That's 60% max HP. That's not bad. Like, it's okay. Obviously, it doesn't actually have any attack moves, which lowers its value quite a lot, but yeah, it's not the worst. Yep, confirm. We could also Let fuse by results some other ones if we haven't got them yet. Wait, we could fuse an Orpheus? You okay with this? Interesting. We can fuse the DLC ones. Hmm. Do you really need we should this? probably fuse some just to fill out our list as well at some point. Uh, I mean, this uses a 5 and a 4. You know what? I am going to fuse this one together. Just to get some stuff. So this one is a... Jenbu. One of the Su Ling celestial creatures of Chinese myth. It represents the direction north, the season of winter, and the element of water. Known to be a great warrior, it supports the earth from below. Oh. Okay. Oh, we'll make it. Select the skills you'd like to oh, what inherit. does Cold-Blooded do? Um, Increases chance of inflicting freeze during one more. We can ref uh, decrease the chance of being inflicted by ailments, or doubles the effect of drain. Uh, we'll just take cold blooded. Although, oh, we can get curse on it, and then we could take drain. What's this do? Doubles the effect of drain skills and passives. You know what? Take that. Get life drain and its power Aya. Will be nothing unusual. Sure. We don't have the my, match, but that's my. okay. We'll just create this thing, and there we go. We have it. I am Jenbu. I shall become a mask and make use of my wisdom to create a profitable future for you. Okay, there's another one. We got any other new ones that don't use the one that we, like, ideally don't use Kushi Mitama, the whole reason we're here. You can get Archangel and Silky together to get a Matador. Oh, and it's Sai. Oh, we should do that because we need Sai. What's this thing do? Increases the period of support skills cast on allies by one turn. Oh, that is interesting, actually. A master sportsman who entertains the audience in exchange for his own life. One mistake can mean death. Some believe that matadors who die while performing remain in this world. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. So we can have that, or we can increase phys physical skills. Or magical skills targeting one foe. I actually kind of think this is better. Uh, and then what do we want to... I think Hammer might be useful to take. It's the instant kill. And... Oh, we did need Garu. Because it's one Will of our few Garus that we have right I now. Want my, my. And we have a Confidant, apparently. A level. Cool. I am Matador. The body of mine, born from the bloody throes of battle, shall be with you as a mask from now on. Cool. That's good. And we leveled up, which gets us map side, which is the AoE side damage. Cool, but now we have side damage, which is really useful. Uh, any other ones? No, I don't see any other ones I want to make right now. Cool. We'll head out of there. You change your map. Oh, let me check itemize. Huh? Ooh, so if we got rid of the Matador, we could get a blood red capo uh, capote. A red cape once owned by a bullfighter. So you, uh, you get rid of the black robe and you get this. Oh, okay, that's neat. It appears it will become something protective. We can make the black rock into a bufu. Did I have multiple black? Oh, I have zero black rocks. I see. I 
give you if I had a black robe, I could make it into that. Oh, I see. Protective. Yeah, so these are the things I could have made with my black rock. So black rock seems to be able to make a whole bunch of different things. Oh, okay. Finished cool. For now. Done already? We are done, yes. What? I, I, I want to go back. No slacking off. Okay. And then we're going to go speak to our counselor. So, uh, back to school. Actually, you know what? Take the shortcut. Yep. Oh, wait, I thought if I go to the bottom... Oh, he just says I'll be waiting in the nurse's office. I guess you can only take the shortcut once. That's fine. Uh, practice building, I think? There we go. Hello. This is rough on my eyes. Are we good? So we got the thing, our bond can grow. Maybe a break wouldn't be so bad. Help him out. <laughs> ah, great. I just finished my counseling session. Now, meet me in the nurse's office. Yep. Well, I'm gonna walk around. Let me know when you're ready to leave. Hmm. I've been getting a lot of students coming in here ever since I arrived here. To be honest, it's been kind of a relief. That whole mess with Kamashiro was the reason I was called here after all. They warned me that a lot of students had been impacted. I knew there would be a lot of free floating anxiety. But when I actually got to talk to everyone, I was pleasantly surprised. Most of the things on everyone's minds were college entrance exams, relationship problems. In other words, typical worries for high school students. Some did open up about deeper issues, but not the majority. Some students were still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes. But at the very least, I'm glad the ones who came to see me have taken some steps towards recovery. Hmm. Um, thanks to you, probably. Well, I can only hope so. I don't think I've done much, but if I've helped even one person, then that makes it all worth it. I know I'm not the most reliable guy, but remember, you can always talk to me too if something's bothering you. I am the counselor here, you know. If nothing else, I'm good at listening. Let's see. Having said that, it's a little awkward that I have to ask for your help, but... You remember how I asked you to help me with my research? Um, of course. Oh. I said you'd be helping with my research, but don't worry, I won't be... It won't be anything too difficult or intensive. I just need you to listen to what I have to say and work through some questions with me. So... But, uh, let's see, maybe I should start from the beginning. I can tell you a little about what this research is for. What I'm studying now is pain felt in the mind, or more fancifully, in the heart. Some specific examples include the pain of someone saying hurtful things to you, or being separated from those you love. Maybe this would be clearer, pain defined by abstract, like trauma or stress. Bodily, physical pain can be thought of as something necessary, an automatic response to injury, illness, whatever. Still... But what about pains felt within one's heart? That pain isn't born from any tangible problem in our bodies, right? It's something strange and immaterial. I guess it goes to show there are still a lot of mysteries in our own hearts and minds. You know, I... And, well... Uh, I, well... I want to learn more about these internal, physiological pains. Now, this is my question to you. When do you truly feel pain in your heart, Zaplacoon? Hmm... When I get punched isn't right, when I lie, when someone betrays me. I think that's the best of these three answers. I see. Yes, I can sympathize there. Sometimes all it takes is one betrayal for intense trust to turn into intense pain. It can be rough. It doesn't feel good to struggle with pain in your heart. For example... But with that in mind, how about the pain of a broken heart then? After all, 
That kind of pain is only born because we fall in love, right? Do you have any thoughts on this kind of pain, Zaplicoon? Hmm. That one seems necessary. True. It proves and validates the love that came before it, after all. A very fitting answer from you. Internal emotional pain can be difficult to deal with, though some say it's always coupled with other feelings. And I agree, of course. I think that's a fair assessment. Though personally speaking, I think if pain can be avoided, it should be. Maybe it shouldn't exist at all. Interesting. This is, this is, I, I can see the threads it's about to pull on for the later stuff. Hmm. Wounds of the heart are much harder to detect, and in a way they're far more complex than physical injuries. That's why I'm doing this research. To save people who are suffering from internal pain, they keep holding on to. You helped me realize that purpose again. Thank you. Did that help? Right. Of course, thanks to you, I can articulate my thoughts once more. I can sense Maruki's gratitude towards me. Ooh, flow. Chance to receive the effects of charge and concentrate at the start of battle. I don't know what those are, but that's interesting. All right. Hmm. Okay, I think that'll do for today. Oh? Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? <gasps> Your mental training! Uh, oh, uh, no. Uh, I didn't forget about our promise, of course. I'll teach you tricks for mental discipline, and you help me with my research, just like we decided, right? Now then, uh, how about something like this today? Thanks to Maruki's mental training, my mind feels stronger. All right. Another five max SP. Oh, and here, never a bad time for a snack, right? Hey, we got uh, Jagariko. Well, see you. Okay, now we're ready to wrap things up. Well, glad he remembered in the end, because I didn't. Oh, this is Maruki. Do you have time to talk right now? I'm taking a breather. Just finished my last counseling session for the day. I thought I'd thank you once again for your help earlier. Um... Good work over there. Thanks. A lot of students came by to talk today. Hopefully they get something out of it. But to be honest, it's pretty rough. It's pretty tough juggling this job and my research at the same time. Thanks again for agreeing to help me out. I might be looking for you to help more frequently from now on. It'd mean a lot if you could lend a hand. Alright, see you later. Cool. Evening. Ah, you're back. Hello. Hey. I wonder if that Yoshida guy is giving a speech in Shibuya again today. Yo. Another box came for you. What did you get? Oh, we got stronger lift S and harder core S and accu speed oh. S. What do those do? That's our next question. Um. So let's have a look. Uh, so yeah, what did he give us? A popular Japanese snack. All right. All right. Well, this this calls for the almighty Google. What is a ja ga riko? It is. What? Are these? Oh! It appears to be, um, chips? Or, um, for Americans, fries? Yes, something like that. Huh. Yeah, they're, they're just, well, or maybe, maybe they're like crisps or something? I don't know. Anyway, they're, they're, they're something. They're some kind of fry-shaped crisp thing. Potato snack. Cool. All right, that's acceptable. I'll, I'll take it. Right, what else have we got in here? So the new stuff. So Dizzy Vile is the one, one we got earlier. There we go. Raises attack for one ally for three turns. Defense for one ally for three turns. 
accuracy evasion for three turns. Ah, so what I would call not very good, because I believe what we picked up there. We did get an IM, though. PR report. I have a report as your strategic image management representative. I just thought of a new way to help you out. I really want to tell you about it. Do you have any time today? This may be a good opportunity to strengthen my bond with Mishima. What's our bond? Our bond is... We need a Moon Arcana. Uh, decide later. So we need to go and get Moon Arcana if we're going to speak to him. But right now, I'm going to end the episode. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.